one is dog's food. My dog that I have in the house will not even eat this thing. My dog will not eat it. Since you have decided to eat from the ground, you will always eat from the ground. Oh, Pan Logo, Oboroko, has she even fed herself? A woman that cannot feed her own children, how can she feed another person? Lazy man. You just sit down and be eating people's food. What else do you know? I am solidly behind you. She is weakly behind you. She's not solid because she's not strong. Her legs are not even strong. You touch her now, she will die. She will faint. Look at the way she's looking. Has she eaten in the past three days? Is the food she brought her for her children that you are eating? No? I'm sure her children don't have anything to eat today. <laughs> a woman that is married in another person's compound wants to come and tell me what I will do in my husband's compound. It's a lie. Hundred people like her cannot face me. All of you put together, a million of you cannot face me. Oh, Mazude, go and tell her to come back that I'm here. Because she knows I'm in this house. She only came out here to make noise. Ranting like a fool. Useless woman. Go and tell her, my children are the first in this compound. And they will always lead. Oh, you cannot do us anything. All of you. handing over right of the family name and responsibilities to me. I will shake the entire town. Watch it up. Watch it up. I trust you. I trust you. Well, you know the size of your pocket. God will provide now. Ah, he's been providing. <laughs> My house. I, the reason why I came is very important. My what? Just a little favor, a very small favor. Nine. What is it this time? <laughs> there was this girl I saw. A beauty that befits me. In fact, this beauty they call tomato juice is nothing compared to what I saw. And we want it all. <laughs> I then went to her parents. You know what they told me? Nine. Wait a minute, okay? Just wait a minute. Are you trying to tell me that you want to get married? Exactly. <laughs> you read my mind. We are thinking of <laughs> Okay. What do you mean again? I have only three wives. My father had seven. Look at the gap. I, I want to close the gap. Huh? And if my guess is right again, you want me to give you money? Exactly. <laughs> you are a true son. <laughs> you are a true son. Now my answer is no. I won't do it. You won't you die? Kid, why are you being negative? With all due respect, now you are the one being negative. You already have enough problems with three words, now you want to go for a fourth one. No! I came to seek financial help. 
I know for you to tell me how to live my life. Nay, my answer is still no. Not on my account, anyway. If it were your father, you would have gone straight to, to help me. I am not my father. And my father did not make this money for me. I am telling you the truth, now. Be responsible. Stop all this jumping around from one woman to another, deceiving yourself with Mary. Stop it, now. Is that the way you put it? Is that the way you put it? No problem. I knew you would be helped this way. You want it? Ah, all right. Okay. I was believing that she now head of the family of Okonkwo, my late person friend, would have regard for my request. When his father was alive, he never refused me anything. Who does Gina do think he is? A little child of yesterday. No. No. This must not go on. The family of Okonkwo must accede to all my requests. Obina must know the truth. Unwanchita. cleaning your car? Yes, I just want to give it a first lift. That's okay. Uh, I'm going to your house now. Not really. Okay. Uh -huh, Obina. Yes. I want you to go and help me say the contractor today. Ah, uh, that's okay. Uh, is it for the renovation of the house? Oh, uh, I thought you concluded with that man. That man is wasting my time. Tell him that if I do not see him this afternoon, the contract is going to another firm. Okay? That's uh, okay. Uh, uh, excuse me. Have you given Mama the money she asked for? Obina, give Mama 10,000 naira. I, I told you I'm broke. Uh, okay, I'll go to the bank. When I go to the bank, oh, I'll go The bank is open today. <laughs> go to the bank. Okay, please. Tomorrow, I'll give her. <laughs> please. Obina. Uh -huh. Give Mama everything. Uh, okay. Let me open the gate for you. I know you might be surprised why I invited you. Uh, yes, honestly, uh, mm -hmm. you are not far from the truth. Our elder say that it is improper for an elder to be at home while a she goat delivers at the data. <laughs> Uncle, you know I'm not very good in all these uh, these their proverbs, and you know I I, I would like you to. Obina, Uncle, how long have you known me, uh, and whom do you know me as? I, I know you since I was born. And I've always known that you were my father's best friend when he was alive. That's very good. When my father was alive, he loved you. And he held you in high esteem. But he gave me one important assignment. 
to protect you and to tell you the truth at the fullness of time about you and Chinedu. You mean Chinedu, my other brother? Your what? My other brother. <laughs> Ngonchita. <laughs> ah! Your father gave me an information about something. And I'm sure he knew about that thing. And he said he warned you about that same thing. So go and do it now without delay. Uncle, you are right. But uh, uh, we live in peace in our family. Besides, uh, I don't know where to start. You live in what? In peace? Yes, Uncle. <laughs> Why don't you go and see your mother? I don't understand. What are you trying to tell me here? Obina, the truth. The truth about your position in that family. Your position in that family. While you think about what I've told you, let me go and get it call. Listening to. And whom are you talking with? That is not the issue, Mama. Why can't you tell everybody his position in this family now that Papa is late? Huh? Obina. 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 They are trying to destroy the love and respect both of you have for each other. Mama, there will be no love and respect if things are not straightened out. Robin, shouting is not necessary. I will shout, oh! I will shout! Mother, why are you being elusive? Eh? Tell, tell him the truth. Robin, what truth do you need to know? Robin, so you want to destroy this family? Stop listening to gossips! Robin, stop listening to gossips! Obina, what's going on here? Why is Mama crying? Uh, she's here to speak for herself. Is she mourning her father again? Excuse me. Obina. Obina. Mama. Mama, what is it? Why are you crying? In order before he left, because your mother used medicine on him. But, but, Papa loved Mama so much. Eh? Yet your mother loves Chinedu more than she loves you. I can't believe this. I can't believe this. After all the love I have for mother. Eh? Obina, Uncle, leave your mother out of this. Just make sure you get what you want. Get what you deserve. That's okay. I thank you very much. Okay. 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 I'll 
will forever be indebted to you. Ah. <laughs> I am doing this because of the love and respect your father had for me. Eh? Thank you, Uncle. Um, Uncle, have this. Ah. <laughs> oh, Bidna. <nice. laughs> okay, there won't be any problem, eh? Thank there will be no problem. Eh? Let me leave. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, should I get buyers for that line? Uncle? No. Eh? Not yet. Uh, uh, let's leave it for now. Okay. Huh? Okay. Uh, where is your car? Um, I left it across the road there. Ah. Uh, yes. Okay, in that case, I won't accompany uh, you. That's no problem. Okay. It's no problem. Bye bye. Thank you, Uncle. Thank you, Obi now. So you have grown wings. You've become so big that you can now point and shout at me. That is not the issue. That is not the issue. <laughs> Just make sure you don't touch anything in this compound. Both the renovation and the title, which is mine. And you forget that I am older than you with many years. Oh, that's the question. That is the question. Why so many years? Why? Open now. I made you what you are today just because you are my brother. How dare you challenge me? How dare you? Mm. So for that, I have to pay you with my birthright, isn't it? Oh, impossible! All right! We shall see who owns the position of Onye Wani. We shall see! Sister, follow me. Chinedu! 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 Chinedu, get back! Chinedu! Sister, what are you still doing? I said, follow me, my friend! Oh! Mm-mm. May God grant you journey mercies. Amen. You and your brother Mike should mind your own business. Do not look for trouble. <laughs> and, and look well before you put your money into any business. Uh, Papa, we promise we will always do genuine business. Okay. Trust me. Mama. Will you, to, will you want to eat now? Your food is ready. <laughs> uh, I will do that in an hour's time. Hmm? Okay. Chukwa, back. Mama. You are still here, talking Listen. with your father. I thought you had gone. No, I, I, I will soon go. I will soon go. Okay. You better leave before it is dark. Okay. Mama. I wouldn't want you to travel in the night. Okay, no problem. Now that you have said it, I will start going. I, I want you to leave before it is dark. Okay, I will. I will. <laughs> okay, in an hour's time. Okay. Uh, so, okay, Mama, thank you very much. As I was saying, groups are all over the places. So, <laughs> so you, you people have to be extra careful. Hmm? Okay, Papa. You can go now. Thank you for your fatherly advice. Mm. Eh? That's why we always come back to the village. You know, anyway, is not far from here. Yeah. We we'll always be coming to the village to get this kind of advice. <laughs> okay, Papa. Yeah. Uh, before I go, I have small token for you. This. Hey. Papa, don't let Mama see you do. You know, I've given her her own. You know, okay. <laughs> just cover it. <laughs> Thank you. Man. Okay, Papa. Thank you. Man. Thank you very much. Let me be. Let me be running. May God see you too. He will. He will, Papa. Papa, go and eat your food. <laughs> Something. Oh, my in-laws, sit down. Let's discuss. So, what can we do for you? 
What's the problem? My in-law. Huh? The problem in my house cannot allow me it. I'm here that we proffer a solution. My in-law, in fact, no, I am confused. Please don't have to, please. I'm confused. It's all right. Wipe your tears. It hasn't come to that. In <laughs> fact, well, I can't. Uh, in fact, uh, but you are in a better position to do something about the situation. Yes, you are. Now, look at it. You are the mother of my son-in-law, Chinedu, and his younger brother. Good. Go to them, and then talk to them. Don't cry. Wipe your tears. Don't cry. It's going to be all right. I fed you. Yes. Thank you. I'll be going. to know why you said and did what you did in the village last week. I should be asking you those questions. Or have you come to remind me of how you met me again today? You're my younger brother, Obinna. Why can't we talk things over? Must other people come into a family issue? I should be asking you that. Our tradition demands that the first son of the family inherits the title and the family compound after the father's death. Yeah, that's right. So, what do you want from me? Nothing. Nothing but to stop questioning my rights. Let there be peace again, Obina. Big bros, if I were you, I would have talked and listened to myself to avoid making endless noise. Let me warn you, for there to be peace, like you said, desist from my right. Excuse me. I'm very busy, as you can see. All right. We shall see who owns the right. You're welcome. Uh -huh. You look unhappy. What's the matter? Did you go to Bina's office as you said this morning? Yes. Good. How did it go? Bad. Obina insulted me. I can't believe this. You mean Obina has the effrontery to insult you? Darling, let's go inside and I will tell you
Think as usual. Well, we are trying to survive with the help of God. Oh, Anil. <laughs> came for your school fees and John's school fees, isn't it? <laughs> You're right, bros. And also to see, you know, it's been a long time I saw you. That's very thoughtful of you. You see, it's unlike uh, John who doesn't want to come out of his mask. He's always running up and down in school, trying to tidy up his carryovers and all that. <laughs> you know, John, you know him very, very well. Anyway, have you eaten? Yes, bros. When I came, the house help gave me some food to eat, and I am okay. And you're okay? I'm okay, very In okay. case you want some drinks, go to the bar, fix yourself some drinks, okay? Yes, Can you help you review your books very well? Very, very well. Very good. Um, have you heard from your dad? Um, recently, no. But I, I'll see him soon. You should be communicating to that one. Yes, bros. Anyway, I'll see you when I come. Let him shout. Bros, you need a... You need a word. Last time. He molested me on my way just now. He did what? Did you sustain any injury? John, where do you think you're going? Sit down. Ify, did you tell him everything I told you? And uh, that you are my younger sister. Brother, I did, but he wouldn't listen. And is that why you're like that? Smile up. Just very, very soon, he will listen with his ears on the ground. We are very hungry. Please just go to the kitchen and prepare something for us to eat. Oh yeah, smile now. Smile for bros. That's my girl. Listen, you know what your bros can do? That's my girl. trying for me when it comes to land issues. Uh, please, don't say that I'm asking for too much. I would like to work on that your land, your personal land in Enugu. The one at Enugu? Yes. Yeah, it will be there. How many times have I told you that you have the right to farm on any of my land or any of our collective land for that matter, without permission. Eh? Are you 
you not working for the good of all of us? I am. Eh, so why are you disturbing yourself? <laughs> I know that that land is large, but since due to my waist pain, I cannot farm on that land again. Please go ahead and farm on there, my dear. Eh? <laughs> Thank you very much, Nai. Thank you. Uh -uh. You are a good send to this family. Mm. May God bless you. You have made me not to think about the death of my husband. Oh, please do not go that far. Eh? I promised my late brother that I was going to take care of everybody in the family, including your children and our children. So stop all this, unless of course you have something else in mind. Ah, nice. <laughs> <laughs> Good night, eh? Huh? Hey. If you see the confidence in opening now, when he was talking to me today. <laughs> ah. Oh, but with me, I don't know what he wants from this matter. You are the first in the family. Which qualifies you for the title, Nyawani? Or does he want to change the tradition? Which he cannot. Which he cannot. I don't know what this boy wants. I don't. I trained him. I gave him my little sister business after he finished school. Hmm. What else does he want from me? So tell me, what else does he want from me? Well, I suggest we go to the village and call a meeting of the elders and invite him before the whole thing gets out of hand. I think you're right. That's exactly what I should do. Something concerning Brad, Chinedu, and Brother business misunderstanding. Well, that is true. I don't just know what's going on for the I have to go by a sense of reasoning. You're okay, fine. Oh, no. You're right. Brother Chinedu has been good to all of us. So good. He made all of us what we are today. And that's right. That way, one won the title. It's his right as the first son of the family. But why would Bina is dragging that with him is what we have to find us out first. Hmm. It's a pity that the devil is tampering with the love in our family and he will not succeed in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to turn out to be a reverend sister. Really? Yeah. Or, or you go to this female convent to oh. stay. So you don't want your sister to get married? No, you get married. You get married. <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> please, uh, please, I didn't know that she's your sister. Shut up! Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Shh! Shh! Ah! Uh -huh. Shh! Uh -huh. Any more shit? Do you hear? Uh-huh. Oh, yes, sir. Okay, sir. Do you ever touch or talk to her anywhere, mm -mm. any time, mm -mm. or any day? Mm -mm. <laughs> no, sir. In fact, I swear, I will never talk to her again. John. I will not. John. I will not. Please. Johnny, it's okay. Let's go. <laughs> the next time you try to do that, consider yourself dead. Uh -huh. Ask of us on this campus. Okay. Idiot. Okay, sir. Don't you ever touch the tiger's tail. Okay, sir. Let's go. Hey. 
Obina, if I were you for the sake of peace, I'll just let this go. Nandi, mm. I know if you were my shoes, you would have done worse than I did. Brother, please. Chinedu is your elder brother, just like you are a senior. And if we disobey, you won't like it. Just let me. Shut up! What do you know? I said, what do you know? The title is mine and I must have it. No, nothing will make me not to have it. Well, look, let me tell you. You can't just be talking to everybody anyhow you like. Just because of your selfish interest. If I... Fine, fine, fine. Just take it easy. Take what easy? What do I take easy? Look at the way Bododina has destabilized the peace and love in this family. Just because of one. One useless and worthless touch that doesn't even belong to him. If I please take it easy. No, no, no. Allow him to run his mouth. He's got mouth. Let him talk. You have got the right to use your mouth anyhow you like. But definitely not in my house. Now leave. What? What? Dad, what did you say? You're still being to leave your house just because of this? No. They had me right. I said leave! I said no! That going nowhere. Eh? Huh? Our wife. It's okay. Hmm? It's okay. The most important thing is that we have fulfilled what brought us to this place today. Yeah? We'll be on our way. Huh? Let us go. But Obina, Obina, I want you to reconsider your stand. Have a rethink and consider whatever that we have told you. Fine, let us go. Vera. Darling. Uh, thank you for the advice. Please leave. Darling. No, shut up. If you want to go with them, you go with them or you listen to me. I'm your husband. I said sit down. Sit down. Why should I leave my title for, 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 for someone just because he is a Chinedu? So because he is Chinedu, I have to I have to abandon my title. It's impossible. The evil you do. The evil you do. that you wanted to tell me. <laughs> My sisters, I have seen what money cannot solve for. Before, uncle, what do you expect money to solve? When the devil is at work. No, 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 no. Leave the devil out of this. For mm -hmm. all I know, the devil is an innocent gentleman in this matter. I mean, how can Obina be so stupid to have challenged your mirror? For Christ's sake, it is disheartening. My sister, what do you want me to say? Somebody that made you what you think you are. But the most annoying part of it all is that the elders in this village are doing absolutely nothing about it. Yes. There you are. There you are. When they may have sold their conscience for money. Eh? What do you want them to do? I'll tell you. Anyway, let's see what's going to be the outcome of next week's meeting with the elders. <laughs> Eh? And what do you expect? What do you expect other than bloodshed? Eh? What do you all expect? Amaka, you are taking this thing personally. I wonder. Or oh, has Omelara bribed you? Eh, 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 I don't want that too. I just don't want that to your gossip. I, I don't want that too. Omelara. Uh, Omelara. Oh, Fine. Vera, what's that? How are you doing, brother? Good night, brother. Ah, brother, can't you see that we're enjoying ourselves? So. Yes. <laughs> That's all right. Vera, brother. Hey, fine. Brother. How are you coping with your studies? Fine, fine brother. brother. That's good. And you, Nandi, what about your business? There's no problem, brother. That's good. Oh, brother. Something more pressing than good business is at stake. What is it? It's a problem with Obin. Please, what can we do to restore the peace that has been in this family? Hmm. 
Nandi, you always talk like an elder. All the same, I thank God for your wisdom. Well, my younger brother will be now misconstrued the whole thing. I... I don't know why. Oh, please do something. You know you are pride. Uh, I mean, if I, if I mean, what you want me to do is a hard nut to crack. Look, that I am the first one is not in doubt. So what would anybody want me to do since the head cannot be the tail? Brother, please, you have to do something else. Still do something, please. It, it's all right, it's all right. Everything is going to be all right, I assure you. Right, thank you. You're welcome. Uh, and darling, please get me a glass, let me join them. Please, uh, this particular matter is getting more complicated as the day goes on. I would like us to know what exactly does Obina want in this particular matter. Thank you. Thank you. Mm, all I'm saying is that Omelora should leave this place for me. Let me take the title. Mm -hmm. Yes, he has a, the best house in this community. He has one of the best houses in the city. He can go and live in any of them. Uh, that's all I can say for now. Omelora. I mean... Omelora. If I had your brother, what do you have to say? I heard him. But please, um, may I ask some questions? Am I not the first son of this woman here? You are. Yeah. And is the possession of the family compound and the title after our father's death not for the oldest son of this family? Yes, it is. It is. I rest my case. Elders, I greet you. Um, we've all heard from our children. We will now adjourn to reconvene tomorrow. But if by tomorrow, both of you fail to settle this among yourselves, we will then give our verdict. My people, I, I, I think I've spoken your mind. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. I will leave. <coughs> Obina. Obina, be very careful. Obina, be very careful. How dare you challenge me in my compound? Obina, how dare I challenge you? This title belongs to me. Are you the only son of the family? Are you the only son of the family? Obina, 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 look at who I am. You're very fond of chanting and brother. Look at who I am.
when you sit in that, can't you sleep? No, don't worry, just, just sleep. Without you sleeping? Oh, oh, Cynthia, stop disturbing me, stop disturbing me. Honey, I'm not disturbing, rather you are disturbing yourself. How do you mean? Go on, ask you more. She is with the solution to your problems. How? Because my father told me that you are not anything to work this time. That is why the Paris cannot stop your brother helping you. I will kill you if you repeat that again, okay? I'll kill you if you don't take your time. Kill me. How many have you killed before now? I've done what I should do. If you know what is good for you, go ahead and do it. And avoid tomorrow's meeting. and we will settle everything here and now else this magic will perform its duty on me and you. Now, Mama, who am I and where am I from? Chinid, is that why you came here so I'm get? Mama, I will do worse if you don't answer my questions in the next five minutes. Five minutes, Mama! Now sit down! Chinid! Mama, sit down! Chinid! Mama, sit down! But you are not from here. What 
am I doing here, Mama? What am I doing here? Mama, talk to me now. Talk to me. Mama, talk to me. I met your father, Kenneth Mama, in Lagos. As young couple, we were close and married legitimately according to our dear custom and tradition. As a government worker, he was later transferred to Enum and relocated to Enum, where I give back to you. But your father had this habit of beating women. He stopped me from work after I gave back to you. Whenever he feels that I demand much money about our house upkeep, he will descend on me. He will descend on me. Until one day, after molesting me and my baby, you. from. So, I and Chinedu will no longer eat in this house, just because of your newfound love. And you have the man to say it? Yes. How many years will it take a woman to be a child? Five years after our marriage, Chinedu came. And two years after Chinedu, nothing, nothing. But if I touch any woman, the result will be pregnancy. How many times will I tell you that child comes from God? Upe. Not man. Upe. Besides, Upe. are you sure it's not other men's pregnancy that you are claiming? What did you say? That not man enough? I'm not man enough. <laughs> <laughs> Let God and this land hear me now. I swear with my life and the life of my generation. My husband will never set his eyes on my son Chinedu again in life. <laughs> <laughs> to my town here, where I got married to Papa Obina. After one year, I left your father. And I gave back to Obina and the rest. So my son, you are from Enugu State. Please forgive me. You are my first son. I love you, my son. Please. Please. My first son, I love you. Please forgive me. I don't know things will turn out this way. Please. Please forgive me. Forgive me. Forgive me. I am suggesting we sell some of our plots of land. 
to support our children in their business. Before some people start dragging those plots of land with us, you know we have so many of them. <laughs> well, your own man, you speak like the woman you are. When your late husband and I bought those plots of land, we knew there were many. But we bought them for our children and our children's children. Mm. One other thing you must realize is that money made out of sale of land is never useful in business. Mm. Yes. Mm. Yeah. The children are doing well in their business, so let us just allow them. They can make use of those plots of land the way they want. <laughs> Thank you, Nai. Thank you very much. Eh? You are so full of wisdom. Eh? Just like your late brother. Well, I'll be going to the farm. I'll try and come back on time. Uh, well, all right. Don't overwork yourself. Bro. I won't. Hmm? I'll do my life. Well. Uh. Are we still going to attend the meeting? Or have you resolved? No. I told him last night and he let her find out the truth. Good! That's very good. Uh, tell me, how did he take it? Did he accept it in good faith? Yes. Beautiful. He left early this morning to look for the town in Enugu State. Beautiful. He said I should tell you. Yes. Please, Papa, I can't go to my mother-in-law now. I'm on my way to Lagos. Tell her for me that I'm off. I am going to do that right away. Hey, but let me ask you, now that you are going to Lagos with this car, with what will your husband travel to Lagos? Mm. After knowing the place, mm. he'll be coming back straight to Lagos. Good. Though he said that you want to go on a bike. Okay. That's very good. Now, my daughter, you've done very well. Thank you. I'm Papa. happy about it. Thank you, my daughter. Take good care. And you sit up there. Is the sound still far? Oh, it's just a neighboring sound. Yes. It's only that we enter the wrong vehicle. Otherwise, it's are stuck at the market square. Hurry. Okay, let's 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 go. Let's go. daughter-in-law say I should tell you that her husband has sent her on an urgent message to Lagos. 
Then, where is my son? Didn't he tell you? Uh, he said he will be going to search for his real father. No, he didn't tell me. But all the same, I wish him good luck. If that is what will please my son. Good. But in the other hand, I, I, I wouldn't like to miss him. After all these years of suffering. He is a legitimate son of another man. You cannot keep him longer than necessary. Anyway, I'll see you after the village meeting. Okay, I'll be waiting. Yeah. Yeah, what? Thank you. Good day, sir. Good day, my son. Please, sir. I'm looking for the house of Chief Kenneth Moma. Kenneth Moma. Who are you? My name is Chinedu, sir. I am a friend of the family. I, I am from Abia State. I want to see him or any member of his family. Hmm. Well, go straight. Just by the left. Second house. By the, by the roadside. Do. Chief Kenneth is dead. But his brother Manzude is always there, just at the front of the house. Thank you very much, sir. God bless you. Please, sir. Um, is this uh, Chief Kenneth Moma's compound? Yes. Uh, and who are you? <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Please, sir. Are you Mazude, his brother? Young man, may I know whom I'm speaking with? My name is Chinedu, sir. Uh -huh. The son of Olamma. Huh? The first wife of Chief Kenneth Moma. Ah? Uh? Ah? Uh? Yes, I am Mazude. <laughs> the brother of Chief Kenneth Moma. Oh. Anna! Hey! <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you, Nai. Thank huh? you. You are the son of Chief Kenneth Mama. Yes, eh? I am. The son of Olama. Chile, this one. <laughs> thank you very much. Hey, God, I thank you that I uh, am alive to witness this event, to, to fulfill the assignment that my late brother gave to me. So you. Hey, <laughs> I, I'll be there. I'll be there. Hey. You're welcome. Thank you, Nani. Eh? Eh? You're welcome. Thank you, Nani. Ah, I'll be there. Eh? Uh, this is Chinedu, the son of your late husband. Good day, man. Which late husband? The son of Chief Kenneth Mama. Go and find him something to eat, please. Go and find him something to eat. Eh? My son. You are welcome. Just sit down. This is your home. Eh? This is your home. Sit down. Let the man. You, 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 are, you have reached your father's home. <laughs> <laughs> I will soon take you around to see all our relations. And then we will see the Igwe. He will very much like to see you. Because he is a very close friend to your late father. That would be very nice. Man. Yes. Yeah, thank you. Yes. Thank you. You are welcome. Eh? Thank you.
you can't get him a plate of food. As if he can afford even one meal for himself. Everything will be there, will be there. And get him a plate of food. Hello? Eh, uh, Mecca? Eh, uh, hey. uh, Mecca? Chukwe, uh, Mecca? There's fire on the mountain. Eh? Uh, yes. Oh! Stop asking questions now. You and your brother are urgently needed in the village now. Yes. Who mm. wants to take all your uh, right to? Who wants to take all your rights? Try and be here in 30 minutes. Okay. I'm waiting. Uh, don't worry. Your mother is in the village. Just come. Uh -huh. How much? I know it will be more than one minute. Two minutes. Two. Soon be here, and you will discover that he is a close and good friend of your father. Yeah. Hey, hey Gwen. you are welcome. Why is you there? It's all well that you are here. It's all. Hey, Gwen, um. All is well, except that things greater than my eyes came against them. And what is that? Igwe, I want you to take a look at this young man and tell me whom he reminds you of. <laughs> Mazidi, <laughs> I can't remember. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> Igwe, this is Chinedu. The son of my late brother, your f good friend, Kenneth. Ah. He is the son of Olama. Ah. Mm. My son! Come, come, come! Come! He is the son of Olama. Oh. Oh. Your father, my pa, was a philosopher. I remember vividly what he told me when we discussed about you many years back. How much do I change? Speak at the meeting. Get it. Since you don't want to bring back your wife, won't you bring back your only son? Forget that, nothing will happen to my son. Let her do the suffer and the training since she wanted so. But let me tell you this today. Chinedu, my son, will come back to his town when the day and hour comes. Mark my words. Really? <laughs> but <laughs> don't you think that you will like the. <laughs> The, the knowledge of our customs and tradition. <laughs> <laughs> that he will learn it back. Uh, he will teach us what he learned. <laughs> Let us drink, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Who 
Udoka! Igwe! Go and bring cola. Let's pray. Igwe! Igwe! Chine do. With my own eyes again. So you are this bad. You are this ungrateful. After all what I and my brother have done for you, good for nothing, lazy old fool. You you never appreciated it in the first place. So what you have chosen to do was to connive with an outsider to take over my father's property, or what my father has labored for. Sorry, the deal is up. We have found out. Oh, you thought we were not going to find out, isn't it? We have found out. Let me there. What are your children talking about? And if I may ask, what have you been telling them? Ude, mind yourself. Just mind yourself. Leave me out of this matter. Inanu. Don't ever mention my name in this matter. Mazude, what are you saying? Just not What are you saying, Mazude? Eh? She told us what all your plans are. But listen and listen very good. Eh? Since you have chosen to be a hungry man, I bet you, you must surely die of it. Uh, please, my brothers, I... Are you shut up, you old fool. You gold digger. So, you have chosen to tread this path. Eh? Listen. By the time I go out and come back here, I don't want to see you in this compound. Since you have chosen to tread this path with this old, ungrateful element. I've just said now. If I see you here again, you will regret it. Don't worry. There must be a way to make them understand. Let's go inside. Let's go. Oh, Wapwe. How is today's wine? The wine is very fine and I love it. Ah, I made it special for you people. I wish you had... Don't the wine tap that lives over the river. I wish you were going to make it better. No problem. I've seen my wife to do and tell him to make a hand on the wine. Oh, bad if I may, doctor. Wake the one and the only town crier. You're welcome. Sit down. One bottle and a plate of bad meat, too. Oh, meat is not your radio. I can wait. Okay, drink first. Oh, okay. So you are here already? Yes. How is your family? We are fine. I'm only waiting for you to finish your discussions with Oba. You can see I've taken two bottles already and I wish to take more if you have the money to pay for them. Oh, you are you enjoying yourself when the whole town is on fire? Meaning what? Why shouldn't I enjoy myself? Mazude is in trouble. Mazude is not in trouble. He's not in any trouble. Only that the boy is poor. Otherwise... Otherwise what? Why must he be somebody into his family when he's already being fed by others? Okay. You are wrong. You are wrong. Mazude did what he's supposed to do as a good father and the head of the family. Uh, is it that the boy is actually a member of the family? Who doesn't know that Akajak married with a child before Obidi after separating with his first wife? Are you sure? Although I don't know the boy because it has been too long. <sighs> Please, let's face our problem. All I know is that uh, they will soon die of hunger. Ha. Okay, well, continue with the wine. I'll make a better one tomorrow. Thank you. They will soon die of hunger. Yeah. Wow. Boy! You're back! Yeah. 
That was the party. Boy, the party was cool. Mm -hmm. Though there was a fight, but there was a love of everything. Bips. Drinks flowing in, out and center. And plenty of music. Yeah. Boy, I had never seen such a party in my life. Really? I'm telling you. Where is Ify, by the way? Well, she just went out some few minutes ago to get some beauties for her breakfast. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah. Who with party server? Eh? <laughs> <laughs> no, sit down, sit down, sit down. Yeah. There's a problem. What is the problem? But they make her called a few minutes after you left for the party. And what did he say? That Papa brought in one hungry looking man, claiming that he's their father's first son from another woman. And all my life, I had not heard such a thing in, in this family. Me too. He said so many things that Papa want to use the gold digger and claim their lands and sell them. He even threatened that if Papa did not eradicate his plants, that we have to go to him for our school fees. And he meant it. Devil. Devil. What is the devil up to now? Hmm, brother. Party man, welcome. Yes. Yes, my sister. But you know that it is good that sometimes you give yourself a treat. Go and dance, do a dance exercise and dance away your problems and sorrows, you know? Yes, <laughs> and at times to dance in a new home. Yes, you're right, you're right. You see, you see, where they go to dance, fight, even break heads. I mean, every... Look at my head. Is, do you have any... Do you not see anything there? You might not see it now. Uh, we will have here tomorrow. No. <laughs> There's nothing like that. It's alright, it's alright. Boy. Thank God you are home. My Inla. You're welcome. Thank you very much. How is the family? Everybody is fine. And you are? We are fine, sir. Thank God for today. Let's go inside. Uh, no, that wouldn't be necessary. I have just come to find out from you whether uh, you've heard from my son-in-law. No, I've not heard from him. But I'm sure he will not have problem with them. It's me he doesn't want. Not the son. Let's hope he doesn't have problem. Mm. Well, I'll be on my way to the village meeting. You know it is this morning. Uh, yes, I know. In law, mm. don't worry. Nothing will happen to my son. I hope you understand what I said clearly. Yes, my son. And uh, Mama, if they make any personal move, Mama, do not fail to call any of our numbers, oh. Eh? Uh -huh. eh, eh, Obo, go and get your car ready. Let me go and change, eh? Right. So, my dog don't look up, oh. I am alive. If I cannot say this come from God, I am alive. Let them come. Now, I am ready to go. Uh -uh. Uh, but I told you that we have not seen all the lands, and there are some of our relations we are yet to see. Uh, Nine, uh, that would have to wait for next time when I come. I have some serious appointments to catch up with. Uh -huh. uh, Nine, since they vowed not to give you any food, I don't want you to make noise about it. Eh? Uh, Nine. Take this 1,500 naira while I manage 500 naira. When next I come with my mother to see if I can convince them, I'll give you more money. Eh? But for now, just manage this. That will be alright. That will be nice. But for the money, just keep it. I can manage. Oh, yes. Me. Ude. Mazude. 
I am known all over the town for hard work. Had it not been for my waist, would I be here to look on anybody for anything? The more reason why you should accept this money. Please. Look, I helped train their father, my brother. And look at the way they are talking to me now, simply because I said the truth. Obedia. Obedia. All right. Nay, please. Stop regretting, okay? Stop regretting. I will go only if you take this money from me. All right. I'll just take 1,000 Naira from you. You keep the rest. I don't want you to be stranded on the road. Eh? Okay, Naira. Thank you. I have to go now. All right. We'll see you off. Is what you want to that God for second? Hey, shh! Don't speak evil of my town. <laughs> well, thank God for somebody like Mazu Day. Thank God. Hmm. So, they would have allowed you to stop it into that compound. Hmm. I think Mama will hear this. Of course, Mama will hear of it. I'm even planning to go back with her to see if it will make up here. Understand my position in that family. Hmm. It is a welcome idea. Anyway. <laughs> Darling, what's the time by your watch? Hmm. I do. So just it's late. We better go to bed. Come on now, let's go. understand him clearly. Now listen to me. Go to your father, ask him to eradicate his plans with his partner. Ask him to send him back to wherever it is that he brought him from. Else, do not bother to come to any of us for any of your school demands. Have I made myself clear? There is something that still baffles me here. We all know Papa very well. Papa hates evil and will never support one. Hey, where are you driving at? Uh, bros, what I'm trying to say is that let us take this matter easy. Let's carry out some investigations and at the end of the day, I am very sure we'll come out with the real truth. Hey, young man. Are you in any way insinuating that uh, we are lying against your father? No, not quite. Jimmy doesn't mean a thing like that. He's only trying to prefer a solution to this problem. And I think he's right. But, uh, uh, so it's all your plans, Abby. 
What's your secret? Now listen to me. Like I said earlier, let me say it again in case you do not understand me. Do not come to any of us for any of your school demands. Now listen and listen carefully. John, James, Peter, or whatever it is you're called. I do not want to see both of you in this house again. The next time I see you in this house, you will regret your deed. Hey, bros, please. Hey, you had him well, right? Now, why did you do that? What did I do? Why did you ask Vera out of your office without giving her what she requested for? Oh. And who are you to question my decision? Obina, why are you like this? Huh? Why are you so unreasonable to tear this happy family apart? Are you not rich? Why not give her what she wants? Were you not the one supporting Chinelu to take over my rights? It is not your right. It is my right. You lie. And if I say no, what happens next? If you say no, yes. If I say no, if you say no, yes. yes. Look, Rubina, you people would have done this when Papa was alive. I will suggest you withdraw your support to that stranger so that peace will reign in this family again. <laughs> Both of you speak like children that you are. You want me to withdraw my support so that peace will reign. And you think that peace will reign by my denying a son of this house is right? My brother will not be happy with me wherever he is. Papa. Can't you see our education is in trouble? I wonder. It is at stake, Papa. If they, if they withdraw from sponsoring us in our university now, how then can we graduate, Papa? Papa, I want to suggest you let the sleeping dog lie. You. The sleeping dog will not lie in this issue. Look, my children, supposing you were in that boy's shoes, will my late brother not have protected you? Huh? Besides, before he died, he gave me an assignment to look for the boy. And now that the boy is here himself, do you expect me to send him away? No way. I will not do that. As for your education, look, I think God is in control. So don't think about what, whether they pay your school fees or not. If the worst comes to the worst, I will sell some of my lands and make sure that you continue with your education. Period. Hmm. Jimmy, let's go see Mama. I just hope it works the way you said it. Me too. I don't know. I don't if know. it doesn't work, what will happen? We have to go to school like every other person. Ah, go to school. No, 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 If you see your mother, won't you recognize her? Eh? Your mother is in hell, and definitely she cannot be me. Oh? Mama, has it come to this? Uh, okay, what have we done to offend you, Mama? In what way have we offended you now? Let's go, Jimmy. She needs some time to understand. Alboro. Alboro Jenga. They call you people twins. One black, one white. Born throw away. Only God knows where they went and picked you up from. Like I said earlier, 
I have forgiven everybody involved in this matter. Mama, you, the elders, for not telling me what they should have told me. And you particularly, Obina. You made a mistake for not telling me early enough. You're my second in command. You should have spoken to me man to man, one on one. All the same, I have put everything behind me. Like I said, I have forgiven everybody. Thank you, Brother Chinedu. Actually, it will seem as if I made a mistake. But the truth of the matter is that I told Mama severally to tell you. Because I couldn't stand before you to tell you this. But Mama couldn't oblige because she felt she would lose you forever if she did. However, Papa Mama, before he died, said if I, I really love you as my brother, I should do everything humanly possible to protect you, else you will die. What? She offered not my brother. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> Why didn't Papa tell me himself? We can't blame the dead now. However, I'm absolutely sorry for the pains this might have cost you. Please, forgive me. Obi, no, it's all right, it's all right, it's all right. Don't bother yourself about that. You see, um, what you did actually pushed me into finding out who I really am. And when I realized my real person, I said to myself, ha, that boy Obi now was trying to save me. <laughs> no, 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 seriously, ask my wife. I told her she's here, ask her. <laughs> so, how are you preparing for your coronation? Oh, well. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> well, I have mapped out one million naira for it. Mm -hmm, that's good, it's all right. But keep your money. I'll bankroll the whole thing. Wow. <laughs> I want to make it a grand occasion for two reasons. Uh -huh. One, it's like um, my thank you present uh -huh. to Obina for saving me. Yes. Hmm. Two, it's like a send off. You know, after your coronation, I shouldn't be coming back to this company. <laughs> This guy had a trouble, my cow. Papa, <laughs> this guy don't declare me to be everybody. If you go to his house, he'll say, Shut up! What in my house? Get out of my house! <laughs> hey, how do we, um, let's get down to the brass tacks, you know. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Let's manage the small thing. Yes, sir. In fine, you're the youngest. Pray for us. In Jesus' name. Amen. Lord, bless and sanctify this food which you are about to take now and provide for those who do not have in Jesus' name. Amen. Pastor, you find me. He said I'll be going with him to his new village. Yes, he said so. He told me. And what did you ask at him? I agreed with him, of course. Uh, you see, since some people didn't want to believe him, I, uh, your presence there will help to change things. I vowed not to step my leg again in that compound. That is why it is advisable for people who have given birth to children to be very cautious in making vows because a situation such as this could change the vow. <laughs> so, Emmanuel. You later became the ego of this town. All to the glory of God. <laughs> All I became. Hmm? So I can still set my eyes on you. 
this is meal. I have a lot to tell my forefathers when I get there. Igwe, <laughs> <laughs> you really were friends. Ah! Your father and I? Ask your mother. I know them if they here. They will tell you. Hola, Beke. Ima. Igwe. Where are they? I don't know the particular plot of land. Where Amazon they took them to? Uh, yes. Okay, what's going to happen is this. Let them go and come. We are waiting for them here. Let them go and come. Yes. Yes. We are waiting for them. We are waiting Very for them. No problem. Nothing they, not they have Mazu. Mazu is down? Hey! Okay. Let them go and come. Hey! 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 They are not looking at us, they are looking at you. <laughs> they see me here once in a while. Huh? So like I was saying, this line of shit, the one behind, and then the lock of shops at the back, they all belong to your father. Oh. I knew when your father bought this land from back up. You still remember? I remember. Glad. <laughs> <laughs> And these ones are for? Ah, uh, these ones are for export. -o. These are the ones that they send abroad. After drying them and packaging them, they send them abroad. Now, this is a big market. Yeah. 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 So, Mazude, you ignored my order. When I asked you not to come to this compound, you decided to, to, to violate my order. Isn't it? Now get out. Get out! Come on, come on. Get out! Come on, move! Don't do this! Come on, move! Get out! What are you doing? Get out! Get out! Get out! Stop this now! Yes. I came because of tomorrow's meeting at Igwe's palace. What about that? Why did you and your children fight that woman? Even when you know that Chinedu is the first son of your late husband. Why? That is why I am here. Bikonu. I have come to ask for your support. I also know that you can convince the other elders to either support me or not talk at all. 
Biko. Eh? Please help me. Well, Biko now. Here. Here, Biko. Take this. What's it? Uh, take it now. Look at it. Take it. Share it among yourselves. Oh. That's money. Yes. It's all right. <laughs> it's all right. Uh, you have no problem. Okay. You can go. Okay. Uh, you see, that he I control him. Okay. Whatever he tells me, we understand. Okay. He will take me by words. Okay. After all, he came from somewhere. Uh, he can I swear. Go back. Go back. <laughs> so. Thank you very much, Nan. Uh, thank you. See, Nan, uh, if you work this one out well, eh? <laughs> More money will come. Is that so? Yes. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not going to disappoint you. Okay. Believe me. Okay, I'm going to do something. Okay, nice. Bye-bye. Uh -huh. Bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Indeed, yeah. 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 Since you said that, you don't know what to say in this open matter. I will use my power as the ego of this community and the best friend of Lord Akajiako, the husband and father of these people here, to pass my judgment. Obi dear. Why do you allow this to happen in your husband's house? Even if you did not know Chinedu, whom I personally gave that name, what of the mother here, Olama? I feel like crying. Because if my friend were to be alive, this will not happen. Instead, it will be merriment throughout. But all the same, it can be amended. Emeka, my son. Igwe. Chinedu is your elder brother. Mm -mm. Impossible, Igwe. Igwe. Impossible. I cannot have a stranger and a visitor to be my brother. It can never happen. Igwe, I can see that uh, you are biased in this matter. Ah. Igwe, that means that you do not know the genesis of this problem. So I advise you keep your opinions to yourself. Yes, this is how you and the elders could knife to take other people's land. Definitely not my own. Not my own father's land. Emeka, be quiet. I said be quiet. Be quiet, you little thing. How do they talk to Aigwe in that manner? Be conscious of yourself. Get seated. I said get seated. Emeka, you have told the tale of a hungry lion. But I'll forgive you. Because of the promise I made to my late friend. If it were another person, you won't last in next morning. Let me take it as if it, it is my son who did this. But let me warn that I, Igwe Obodu, will not tolerate something similar next time. Is that clear? Hi. Are you still here? Mama? I can see you people are still interested in this matter because I have lost interest in it. Eh, hey, Mazude, you've been masquerading under the guise of a quiet and a nice man. So, your plan to connive with an outsider to take my father's property, it will never happen. Heads must roll, definitely not my own head. When you finish, come to the house and take the property, let's see. You push, should come. Mama, I won't go. And I'm. Do my son. Listening to Mazio there is a good man. Whatever I ask you to do, do it. Whatever I want to build, build. If you don't have money to build, come. I'll give you money to build at least three rooms for now. This is your town. Ndiche. I have spoken. I thank you, Igwe. I thank God for your wisdom. 
and I thank you for your endurance and accommodation. May God continue to bless you. As for the house, I have one that I'm sharing with my twins, and we can accommodate some more. So he can stay with us, uh, Emma. Igwe, Ndiche, my people, I am overwhelmed by emotion. I don't know where to start or, or what to say. But for now, let me just say, God bless you all. Thank you. You great. Yes. Yeah, it's what is it? Can I help you? I came to see you, bros. Uh, but let's go inside, bros. What for? Oh, have they sent you? Listen, if they sent you, tell them that you didn't meet me at home. Now, listen. You have just two minutes to say whatever it is that you have to say. Have an appointment to catch. Uh, bros, I came to report Ifoma to you about her sudden change of attitude on campus. Bros, you need to see how Ifoma dresses and walks about the campus. Ifoma hardly sits down to study her books. We have tried to talk to Ifoma to make her understand to see reasons, but Ifoma would not listen. How does that concern you? Is it your business? Whatever Ifoma does on campus, what business of your sister? Is it for your sister? She is my sister. Okay? So whatever she does is not of your business. What I would advise you to, to do is to go to your father and advise him about his recent change of attitude. Okay? Instead of nosing around, looking for whom to change. I mean, have I been able to control your father's attitude? Hey, listen. For the last time, stop nosing around people's attitude. Leave Ifoma to concentrate on her studies. Have I made myself clear? Now, get out of this compound. Because if you don't, I'm going to break your legs right now. Don't try me, stay there. Nanyude, please manage this one. My son knows what is good for everybody. And I promise he'll be coming from time to time to see you people until he's finally settled. I have told you that I am not interested in money. All I'm interested in is to see that my son comes back to his fatherland. <laughs> Nanyude, don't bother yourself about that. I'll soon come home finally. Uh -huh. uh, but please, accept the money so that Mama and I can start going. Please. All right. <laughs> All right. I'm looking forward to seeing you back here. I promise I'll come back. I'll come back. <laughs> Jimmy, what did you say for Emeka did when you visited him? <laughs> Tony, the way these people are going about the whole thing is getting disgusting. In the first place, he didn't even allow me to enter into his house. And after I told him all the stories, do you know what he did? He ignored me and drove away in his car. I blamed Papa in the first place. But, come to think of it, Papa is right. 
think so. How do we expect Papa to support Ivo simply because he wants us to go to school? And I also think that Papa is trying to save us from an impending doom after him. But the fact still remains that Mama did not want her children to reason. Truly, she doesn't want them to reason. Anyway, with this part-time teaching, we can sustain ourselves for the remaining two years. Exactly. Johnny, you have spoken very well. That is true. It's only God that will save us. And let's see, probably by the weekend, we have to travel and see Papa and see how he's doing. Just do that, just do that. Because things are not going to continue like this. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> they even called my son a gold digger. We shall see who is the gold and who will take it. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> um, what you mean? So, when do we have to pack up finally? Well, I'm um, soon after your coronation. I would like to go with you. If not for anything, to see where Ma was first married. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I promise you, you will like my town. At least it's better than your town. Ah, you know you are not saying the truth. Let go, people. I should know better. I've tasted both places, okay? No, forget all the harshness from my brothers and their mother. Okay, my town is heavy. This, Come. my town is the best town on earth. Hey, 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 hey. And you know it. Look. Come and see our farmlands. Beauty. Ma Mama, you know. <laughs> you know. The farmlands are wonderful. And you think we don't have farmlands? And I have some investments there. My dad has already moved from this. Hey, this is a good place. You like it. You like it. You like it. You like it. Do you know? I tried to make her see reason. But she bluntly refused to listen to me. Imagine. Hey, hey. It is over my dead body that a woman married into this family will chase my brother's son away while I fold my hands. Well, no, it can't happen. Not when I'm alive. No, no. Good. Maintain your stand. I am solidly behind you. I must have to prove to her that though I am the only daughter of this family, I am more than a match to her. If she's mad, hey, hey, that madness of hers, I will cure it for her. Eat this food and drop the plates. My children will carry them when they bring your dinner. Thank you, very I am going. Thank you, my sister. Thank you. Greet them for me. She will die. She will faint. Look at the way she's looking. Has she eaten in the past three days? Is the food she brought her for her children that you are eating? No? I'm sure her children don't have anything to eat today. <laughs> A woman that is married in another 
person's compound wants to come and tell me what I'll do in my husband's compound. It's a lie. Hundred people like her cannot face me. All of you put together, a million of you cannot face me. Oh, Mazude, go and tell her to come back that I'm here. Because she knows I'm in this house. She only came out here to make noise. Ranting like a fool. Useless woman. Go and tell her, my children are the first in this compound. And they will always lead. Oh, you cannot do us anything. All of you. Dara. It's me, Chinedu. Ah, Chinedu. Nay. What is the meaning of all this? Nay. I came the way I came then, so that I can be accepted for what I am, not for what I have. <laughs> oh, my dear. Oh, uh, Maybe she's not around. I saw her around a while ago. Oh, uh, Maybe she's not around. Oh, mm -hmm. uh, you're welcome. Thank you, sir. Now, so Nai, please meet my wife, Cynthia. Uh, Nai, you did. Oh, Acharuga. <laughs> no, um, you're welcome. My and my sir. younger brother, will be now. Uh, uh, be now. <laughs> Good evening, sir. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. Thank you, sir. Hey, yes, we sir, have to welcome. leave the kids behind. Look, if I die now, I have not died useless. Uh, you, you are not going to die today. There are so many good things in store for you. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Let's go and see the Let's go and see the Let's go and see Join me, my father. Uh, uh, join me, my father. Uh, open the door for me. Uh, <laughs> Good evening, sir. Join me, join me. Where is it? How do I find it? My little center. Hey! Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on.
arrival to the palace. Your noise is all over the community. You are truly the son of Akajako. It is in the head that the eyes stay. Meet your plan. You are all welcome. Udoka. Kola. Koros. Uh, don't waste any time at all, at all. Yes. Yes, there will be the people that will buy the land. Okay. I... Huh? Okay. I'll be waiting, eh? Come now, now. Come now, now. Adima. Bye. Ngwan. How much? A minute, twenty nine. Igwe, my son, Ndiche, my people, I thank you all. I want to thank you for seeing the truth and saying it. Uh, the last time I was here, I said I had nothing to say. But now, I want to show my appreciation by asking Igwe to show me where he would like me to build a new and befitting palace for him that will benefit our community. Thank you. The Igwe Adej says that he had a call Gone a day. Mbalo. Mbalo. You are truly the son of your father. What you did is a repetition of event. Your father single-handedly built the first palace after the war. That is true. And now history is repeating itself. <laughs> we thank you very much. Mm. Um, but before we accept the offer. We must know what he has for my Jude. <laughs> I have no problem whatsoever. Obi no Hambanoa. I am a very happy man today. As we were coming here, Oh Melora Chinedu said he was going to fly me abroad for my waist pain treatment. Eh? And Igwe, if you look into that briefcase, he has plans for a new palace. A house for me and houses for himself. Indeed, <laughs> 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 here with this, we accept your offer. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> My son, my cabinet and I have resolved that the Ochiaria title, which was to be given to your father before he died, be given to you now. Igwe. 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 <laughs> so you can come whenever you want. Ochiaria. Igwe. My son. I thank you very much for this big shoe that you've given to me. And for this reason, Igwe, my people, I shall do something to merit such a title. Mm -hmm. I will set an examination in our school 
that will give me seven best pupils from the seven villages that make up this town. And I shall award scholarships to all of them from class one to the university. Igwe, I am happy that my late brother Kajaku is alive again. He is. He is. Igwe, as we were coming here, children do Ochiara, Ochiara here was asking me where would I find a piece of land to build my own house? Igwe, we shall all now go to all those pieces of land that we own, and Ochiara will make his choice of lands for his house or houses. <laughs> Eh? Yes. Yes. What are we waiting for? Let us go now. Hey. Now. My spy told me that they are in one of our biggest land at Epa. At Epa. Okay, Mama, do you know what you're going to do for us now? Mm. Don't leave this compound. Eh? We are going there to meet them. But in case they come back here before us, call us on phone. Eh? But we are coming back immediately. Okay. Eh? I'll be for us. Here on the left. Now you dead. So this is your plan. Hey, yeah, I do. Stop I tell there, you, there. you will never succeed. Stop okay. there. I you will not. Up. And who are you? How stop dare there. you talk to my brother like that? If you move, God will down. punish you. God will punish you. Don't allow me to squeeze you in my hands! Obina, Obina! Look at your sabental face! It's okay. It's okay. He's also my brother. Emeka. Listen and listen good. Once beaten, twice shy. I have given you and your brother enough time to rethink and be my brothers, but you've chosen not to. Let me warn you for the very last time. Do not allow your low sense of reasoning drag you to an early grave. 
I am giving you another chance to rethink or dance naked in a pot of hot soup. Good day. We shall see who dances naked in a pot of soup very soon. We shall see. No, 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 no. Point of correction, my boy. You shall see. For me, I have already seen the very good things of life. When you see, pray to Almighty God that you do not see the bitter side of life. It may be worse than hell. Now get out of my sight. I am waiting for all of you in my father's company. Get out of my sight! And you! Monkey! Look at your head! Your hey, head is Akamukes. Let me see you. Go, 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 go! It's Ross. I would... I... Have you seen it? Have you seen it now you dead? I'm sorry about that. So like I was saying, the land on the right, this one, is uh, the one he inherited. The ancestral land that is own share of ancestral land. So which means I can build anywhere. Right. I can choose from wherever. <laughs> <laughs> this is good. This is good. This is good. Obina, I told you. <laughs> my place is bigger than but yours. It, yeah, it can never be better. I don't know if it's better. Check out my father's place. Bigger than the town. <laughs> Ah, Amy here and Mike. How are you? Fine. I am just on my way to your house. Did you... When did you return from Lagos? Just this morning. But why are your faces like this? Honestly, that is problem. Can you imagine Uncle Ude, our father's brother, brought an imagined brother from nowhere, claiming that he's our senior brother? And now they are all planning to take over our father's property. And we are saying no to that. Come out from the car. In fact, that is the reason why I left Lagos last night. But I hope you made no troubles with him. Ha. Okay, just talk. Just no matter. Just talk. Your father has no property to be claimed by Chief Melora. He is almost the richest Igbo man in Lagos. Okay. Right now, as I am talking to you, our town people at Lagos are jubilating about the news. We are planning an ovation reception for him. In fact, count yourselves lucky that he is your blood brother. God. Uncle, is it true that our father married two wives? Yes, of course. Your father married my sister, your mother. Just when the first wife left with her son. You know, Uncle, are you insinuating that Chinedu is our real blood brother? Yes, of course. Hey. Emeka, but my wife didn't tell us this. No, 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 no. That must have been a mistake. I'll be in your house later in the day to see my sister. Okay, no problem. We'll be going home now to, to see her too. It's okay. And please, greet uh, Mama Ngozi for us. All right. How did it go? Eh? Mama, how dare you? Eh? How dare you deceive us in this manner? How dare you? Deceive? Mama, you should have told us the common truth. Deceive? You should have told us the common truth. Oh. Mama, you should have told us the common truth that Chinedu is our brother. 
you know what you would have done to us? We would have been shot dead there. All because of your lies. I'm going inside to pack all your things. So you are leaving this compound today, today. You are leaving this house this very moment. Too. Hello. Hello. Hey, they have charmed my children. Oh. They have charmed my children. Okay. Oh. It's all about charming here. Yeah. We have known you. Hey, Mike, go inside there. Pack all her belongings. You must leave this compound. Ah, stop hey. it. Stop it, I say. You wizard. You have bewitched my children. Stay out of this. Mazide, it's a lie. Come with you too. Don't go anywhere. Stay. Hmm. Obi there. Nobody bewitched your children. But they are free from your lies. Uh, my children. Things are not done in this way. Hmm? Um, tradition forbids that a child send the mother packing. It is never done. Obidia has made a mistake. But she made the mistake because of the love she has for you people. Uh, she wanted to be the head of this family. But she forgot that the ways of a man are different from the ways of the Lord. So please, I beg you to forgive her. Eh? Emeka, forgive her. I'll find a way to have a word with the man. Let's go into the house. My children, this is the hour of reconciliation. It is the very hour that I've looked forward to. Emeka, over to you. No. You have to talk first. I have no mama. Now your day is right. I have to apologize. Yes, me too. Uh, please, uh, uh, please, 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 no, no, please. Just go back to your chairs, please. Please. I hold no malice against anyone. In fact, I'm very proud of the great brothers I met in my father's compound. But I want you to understand that I did not come into this family to destroy it, rather to build it up and make it stronger. Please, let's just forget the past. Let bygone be bygone. Let us just forge ahead as one united, indivisible family. The students in our midst should follow me down to Lagos. They will complete their studies abroad. It's all right. 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 And um, the two of you who are already in business, if you want to, you can go back to your base, sell everything you have, bank your money. Then you can come down to Lagos and um, tell me anything you want. Anything and it's done. <laughs> Thank you very much. I don't know how to say it. Yeah, I don't, come on, come on. You're my brother. You're my brother. Thank you very much. You're my brother. Um, if I want to go in and uh, get the drinks and the tumblers. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you, man. You're welcome. <laughs> what are you talking about? Yes, Mike. This is the land. All of this. <laughs> this land is massive. But don't you think it's rather too big for a house? Well, this land is not for a house. It's for a factory. A factory? Hi. But that's an enormous project. Too. <laughs> I mean... Why build a factory here? Because, Mike, it is high time we brought development to this land. With a factory named after our late father. In that case, I am going to supply the building materials. Yeah, look at <laughs> that, me, me, I will handle the supervision of this project. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right, it's all right. Look, I am really glad we're working on this as one, okay? Uh, but first, to secure the land, we have to see the village council. I hope Mazu Day is aware of this. Hey, come on. Definitely. Definitely. <laughs> hey, this house is big. Oh, this is big. 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 Big
Ndicho mala re wetara nyoju ondo mala re nando bodai nando ndo ndo bla choro mala re kala oro ra anyi onka nuzu nko kwere ra anyi ihe oro anyi dinuku anase omela ora oga dere mma dere bodai anyi mma dere nne dere nna dere nde chere ihe oma aga toje atitando se It is with great joy that we all are gathered here today to celebrate the good news brought to us by an illustrious son, Chinedu Akuruna. He has decided to build a factory here for us, and you all know what that means. As agreed, the land is hereby given to him free of charge. <laughs> Let us hear from him. <clears throat> Elders of our land, I greet you all. Thank you. It is with great respect and pleasure that I stand before you all today to be commended and encouraged towards bringing this development to a land which I have really, really come to love. You all know that with the factory would come good roads, employment, and other basic amenities needed to sustain life. Together with everybody in this village, we shall attain that height that will benefit this community for many years to come. <laughs> Once again, I thank you all. Akurun, Akurun, I want to thank you all for the respect you accorded my other brother here and our family for giving us the opportunity to express ourselves. Um, in return, we have a late to refreshment for all of us here after this we just march down to the house you know to get ourselves enjoyed how can we just give out our community land to people how can they well they said after the factory that we all get jobs yes they will also provide us with uh, good routes, increase the number of our light transformers, and uh, provide the whole community with good water supply. Did you hear yourself? Yeah? They said, they said, they said. That's all there is to it. How many times have our elders spoken and accomplished their words? How many times? That is true, there. I'm going to think of it. Our families are part owners of that land. Oh. How are we sure our elders have not taken money from that money ritualist? Oh. How are we sure? Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, we have to go and see the elders. Yes. I suggest we see them. Mm -hmm. And if we agree to go, we have to speak with one voice, one, and who one mind. Talk? And who will do the talking for us? I will do the talking. Okay. Leave that for me. Yes, so we will do the talking. But are you sure the elders will listen to us? Why are you being so negative now? Eh? Just do as I said first. Let's see what will come out of it. That's exactly what we will do. Yes. Eh? We have decided to go. Eh? Yes. So when are we going? 
their next general meeting. Yes, yes. 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 We will go and see them. Yes. yes. Face to face. One, you didn't come with your bodyguard and your effort. I hope you are safe. <laughs> you have a very nice sense of humor, Mama. <laughs> I'm already safe with Mike and they make around. Yeah. Hi, brother. We didn't see you yesterday for the appointment to Slater with the land surveyors. <laughs> the elders didn't give me time at all. Even today, I have a meeting with the Igwe. <laughs> you mean you now sit and discuss with the Igwe? <laughs> Mama. The Igwe is human like all of us, and he's a very nice person too. Uh, brother, you have to come in and eat some food, eh? so that we can sit down and discuss in detail, since yes. we didn't have the appointment yesterday. Come in and eat some food. I prepared pounded yam and bacon. <laughs> Mama, With thank you. Uh, well, I trust you, I trust you, but no thank you. I told you I had a meeting, but I have a meeting with the Igwe, and he's already waiting for me. Besides, I have to take two of my cars to the mechanic in town. Ah, ah brother. Me and Emeka can help you do that, um, brother. Yes. <laughs> my Emeka and uh, uh, Mike, they will help you do it. After all, they are your brothers. Look, Mama, I know they are my brothers, but let me do that myself, okay? Uh, um. <sighs> Mama, take this 50,000 naira. Buy some drinks and entertain your friends for me. 50,000 naira? <laughs> Well, <laughs> 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 right, all right. Uh, well, 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 uh, Mike, take care. I'll see you when I come back. Okay, now. Thank you. Again, this time, what is it? How could you be so low as to accept being the driver and mechanic of that boy, even in my presence? How could you? He's my brother. What is wrong with that? There's everything wrong with it. Everything. He now discusses with the way. Very soon, they will make him the owner of this community. Both of you will be bound down to him instead of him bound down to you. Mama, we should be thinking of unity and progress, Mama. Unity and progress, my boots. Only a coward goes in the face of battle. He is supposed to win. Both of you are in disgrace. That stupid children. Ashamed of you. Mike. I said, what is Mama turning into? Leave Mama. What is wrong with her? Leave Mama. She will soon come down. Yeah? But I do at least try and leave Mama. Relax. My fellow elders, I greet you. Mm -hmm. Few women of this community have some grievances as they want to express. I don't know what it is, but I advised that instead of them going to Igwe direct, let them table it here before us. Yes. If we cannot solve it, then Igwe will hear it. Oh. All right. All right. Well, our wives, what is the problem? Feel free to tell us. I am speaking for them because I am at the center of it all. It's all about my stepson, Chinedu. Do you mean Omolara? Well, he's still Chinedu to me. You see, 
these women are widows. And their only hope of survival is their share of that community land given to Chinedu to build a factory. Uh, well, uh, our wives, I want you to understand what is coming to us. The factory will bring development to us all. Is there anything wrong with that? Yes. We want the land back. Yeah. I am speaking like this because if anything should start happening, I will be the first to bear the brunt. Umeno Rachinedu has called surveyors. He has valued that land with estate valuer. The cost for each family share of that land will be paid by Igwe. Mm -hmm. okay. Who gave out the land? But in my, the issue is that Our we, elders, since he will pay, we accept. Yes. Mm -hmm. I am still talking. Let me finish first. There is no further need for agreement in this year. We accept Igwe's offer. Yes. 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 Thank you. Mm -hmm. Well, since you all accept, the meeting is over. Yes. Ah, uh, women, we can now start going. I will continue our meeting. What came over you all? What the rubbish was that over there? It is better to collect the money from you than fight off. We are all cowards. Cowards. Is it to say? Is it because your children are where to do? Okay. You see now. The plan was to stop the factory and retain the land, not to take money. The money the Igwe will give to us, it would be enough for us to buy another land elsewhere uh -huh. and have enough balance. Yes. Yes. Moreover, we will get jobs at the factory. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Our children will get jobs there in future. Yes. Yes. Don't you understand? I am totally disappointed in all of Thank you. you. Thank, Thank you. you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. My children are the first in this compound and they shall lead just as their children will also lead in their own time. Before the gods, I was married into this compound. The oracle celebrated. The elders drank in jubilation and my husband looked upon me like a queen. No stranger can shall take that away from me. No stranger. Chinedu, I stop your source of money. I bind you and your wealth. You will fall on your knees and beg my children for food. of the women of this community over the land given to me to build the factory. My son, don't blame them. Most of them are widows. 
They were my mothers and elder sisters. I can understand the fears. Our son, the Igwe himself has stepped into the matter and has promised to compensate them. And we need that factory. And the Igwe should not worry himself. He will not spend a dime on any project for this community <laughs> as long as I, Omeluora, am alive. That's great. That's great. Do you believe what we have just said? Yeah. Hey, wonderful. You have proved yourself a worthy son of your father. Thank you. Uh, but not only that, my elders. I am giving free education yeah. to all the primary school pupils of this community. <laughs> I, I heard about uh, the free education you gave to all the primary school students um, in our community. Emeka, it's their birthright. You see, God has blessed us, so we must share it around. <laughs> My God, but you can't believe it. All the community people are dancing and lauding you at the same time. Uh -uh. They are not lauding me, they are lauding Papa's name. God. How I wish Papa were alive to see all this. Hmm. His soul must surely be resting in peace now. Yeah. Amen. Amen. And amen. And amen. <laughs> um, Amika? Yes, brother. Um, when the factory is completed, friends of mine from all over, from within the country and outside, will be coming for the opening ceremony. I don't want them to come to this house. Brother, what do you want me to do? Rob a bank? <laughs> well, here is a check. I want you to tear this old house down and build something classic. My God. Brother. All this money? I mean, for Christ's sake, we don't need to. We don't have any reason to touch this house. With this, we can build a big mansion elsewhere. Do whatever you want to do. Just build something classy, okay? Just give me five months. The house will be ready. Okay, no problem. You will work with something classy. Come on, you're yeah. my brother. I don't come on and say Thank you very much. This is good. <laughs> It's not working. Okay? It's not working. Instead of this world to be disappearing, it's rather waxing stronger. What is the meaning of all this? The king has never given me anything that does not work. So why is this one not working? Huh? He asked me to give him the whole 50,000 naira she didn't give. I gave it to him. I said it. This chinedu is into rituals. That is why it is not working. Look at even, even Mazude. He has sent Mazude abroad for treatment. And me, Obidiye, will stay here. And everything will pass in over me like that. No. I would have liked to go back to him. To do a stronger ritual for me. But he has one minute to come back. Maybe I should go and look for somebody else. Eh? I can't go and look for somebody else. I can't just sit down and fold my hands and, and be watching things go like that. I have to do something about it. No, I will not sit down. If you won't answer me this time, I will go and look for somebody else. He took the whole money Chinedu gave me, 50,000 Naira. I said he was going to prepare a strong blessing for me. I'll have to look for money. Somehow. 
That's what I will do. Uh, I call you personally because Emeka has become so stubborn because of the little money Chine do flashes around him. <laughs> Mama, that's not little money. Besides, Chine do give Emeka money to renovate the family house. Oh! So we are now beggars. So much that we depend on charity to renovate our house. Mama, that's not the issue. Why exactly did you call me? I have uncovered Chinedu's source of wealth. <laughs> well, that's no secret. Chinedu is a renowned businessman. Stop talking like a fool! That's what you want the world to believe! Mama, people are beginning to gossip outside you. Good! Every gossip has an element of truth, no matter how small. Chinedu is a ritualist. Mama, Mama. How many years have you and your brother been in business and yet you have not been able to make the kind of money he's flashing about? How many years have you been in business? Okay, Mama, what do you want me and Emeka to do? No, you are talking. Very good. She never has no two heads. What is in her If you know what he did to make money, both of you should go and do the same and make your own money. Hmm. And... Mama, I guess they're not serious. So. I am dead serious. More serious than you can imagine. I am serious. Serious. Well, welcome, welcome. Thank you. You don't look happy. What's the problem? <sighs> Uncle, everything is the problem. Ever since Chinedu left, my business has been going down. You don't need Chinedu to succeed. You've made enough money from the land you sold to run this business. Eh? Yes, Uncle, but the, the, the more I do business, the worse it becomes. That's the problem. That's the problem. <laughs> you are doing fine if you ask me. How? You are doing fine. Uncle, how can you say I'm doing fine when I just lost 4 million naira in the last business I did? One cheater. How I wish Chinedu was around to help me out. Obina, you talk like a child at times. The same Chinedu who bewitched you is the person you're craving for now. Eh? I don't understand what you're talking about, Uncle. You are a victim of spiritual attack. But I know you won't understand because you are too young to. You are too young to. Uncle, 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 spiritual attack. What, what, what kind of spiritual attack are you talking Chinedu about? has changed you spiritually. Do you think he's, he's happy after losing out? But uncle, I took what rightfully belongs to me. That's all. <laughs> Chinedu has made poverty your portion. Yes. But I know a man who can break that chain. Somebody can break the chain. Otherwise, why should everything you put your hand into fail? Why should you do is succeeding? But is it normal? It's not but it's not normal. Uncle, but I took what rightfully belongs to That's me. what I've just said. Why should he be succeeding while you're failing? I want you to it's never proper, it's not normal. Robin, I don't like your new relationship with Udemba at all. What are you getting from that evil man? Mama, I don't care about how you see Udemba. I don't care. Robin, you better open your eyes and realize in time. The grave is helping you to dig. <laughs> is it because Udemba instigated me to fight for my right? Huh? What right is that? The right that told you and your brother apart? Is that the right? Chinedu was never my brother and he can never be. Now listen. I conceived him in the same womb I conceived you. 
Now he has left everything for you and walked away. But now you cannot account of any parties he left for you. Mama, I'm just respecting you because you're my mother. That is because she has been fighting me. But I promise you one thing. As long as I live, I am going to fight him with the last drop of blood in my body. No one is fighting you. You are the one fighting yourself. As long you continue listening to that evil man, Utemba. You have complained of business failure for quite some time now. Yes, Uncle. Actually, my business has been going down for some time now. Now, there is a friend of mine in Portacourt. And there's this business proposal from him I want you to consider. Uh, uh, what is the nature of the business? Good. <clears throat> Who is into importation of guns and bullets? Okay. Guns and bullets. Importation of firearms? Yes. Ah, count me out. I, I, can't, I can't do that. I can't do that kind of business. C can't do what? I can't do that. Huh? Hey! You want cheetah? Obina, you said they can't do what? They will remain poor forever. Remain poor! That's the business Chinodo has been doing for years, and he has made so much money. I can't do that. They remain poor. Don't ever call me again. Uncle, uncle, uncle. Look, that's a very dangerous business. I, I might be arrested by the police. Who told you that? Who told you? I took you to Omoka, the powerful little doctor. Only when I'm all blush here, I'm not going to pay. Are you afraid? He made you invisible. There is no business you put your hand into that will fail. Eh? Hmm. You want cheetah? But, Uncle, you know that business requires a huge amount of money. Mm -hmm. And I, I don't have that much now. Eh? You have to invest before you reap profit. Whatever you have, you invest it if you, if you desire to reap profit. So your plus of land, the land you inherited, and invest the money. I am behind you. I will get you buyers. Uncle? I will get you buyers. What did you just say? I have only two plus of land left. And you are the one that helped me in selling every other thing. I am aware. Except those two. Sell the one. two. Obina, sell the two. Eh? Mm. When this business starts flourishing, you will make a lot of money. Whatever you want to do with money, you will see the money. You try to man, you will see the money. You try to go to the Eh? Invest. Sell, sell the plot of land. Oh. Eh? Take about, at times, you, 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 uh, I, that reminds me. You said something that Mama said. Um, Brother Chile do did, you know, money ritual um, before he became wealthy. That what she told me. She even said that she knows the place. My God. Listen, Mike. Yeah. Don't be deceived. You see, right from the first day, Chile do set his foot into this compound. Mama deceived us into believing that Chinedu is an enemy. We fought him. We did all sorts of bad things to him. Yet he forgave us. Accepted us as his blood brother. Please. We should not let Mama's arrogance and ignorance deceive us. But brother, come to take of it. You know that Tinedu has too much money. I mean, when did Tinedu start his business? When? Christ, what is your business? 
what is your concern there? How does it change your lifestyle? Listen, within a short period, he has helped this community. Very soon, a factory will be built here by him. Mm, it's means, a plus. Then that means we should join him in his type of business. I know he has a lot of connections. So let's join him. Christ, why must you join him in his business? Listen, he has opened his arms for us to come in. He told us, sell whatever thing you have. Come. He will give you money to do whatever thing you want to do. Why would you want to join him in his business? That means you're not grateful for what he has done. Listen, listen. Instead of nosing into his private affairs, we should at least join him to support him to actualize his projects. See, he's our brother. Well, that is the only thing I can tell you. I wonder where they might be. I, I really need to see them, Mama. I really need to see them. Uh, okay. Come in there. Let me go around and look for them. Okay. they're around somewhere, perhaps I should wait for them. No. It's not necessary. They've all eaten. Besides, I still have a pot full. Hmm? Just go ahead and eat your food. If they come back and still want to eat, they can go ahead and eat with you. Okay. Let me wash my hand then. Let me go and look around for them. Okay. No? Thank you. I can hear you now. What is it? Paul, you can handle the business. Handle it until I come back, okay? No, oh, yeah, it's all right. It's all right. <coughs> hey, Mama, she always gives you for us. She won't even ask if you're hungry or not. Well, I'm hungry. I must eat it. Ugh. No, Jesus, my not devil. Ah, my God. You're eating my food. I thought it's my food, though. <laughs> I didn't even know you're around. Um, uh, when I came, Mama said you guys were somewhere around. No, she was going to look for you people. Like no, I was behind the building. Uh, I went to see Edike. No problem, just continue eating. Let me let, let me join you. What is it? What what is it? Mike! Mike!
Stupidity and wickedness has caused the death of your son, Michael, for no good reason. And in sadness, we buried him. Judgment is left in the hand of God. And they say no one, no one can stop the sun from shining, nor the moonlight at night. And they say, that anything that goes around comes around. This clan, Obidia, can never and ever forgive you over this. With the anger in our hearts, we would have insisted on an eye for an eye. But this justice has been tampered with mercy. Obidia, you are hereby banished from this kindred. You shall leave. But before you leave, Emeka, what do you have to say? Ndiche, Eke Nemun. Ndiche, I will always stand for justice and truth. And there is no enemy of progress that will be part of my life. Michael is, is, is dead today. The judgment awaits you, mother. Today, you shall return back to your people empty. Because empty, you came into this compound. When you get to them, you explain to them exactly what you have done with Michael. That is all I have Mike didn't deserve to die. All this just because I extended some goodwill to my people. Even though the mother wanted to kill me, why should Mike die? He needs your help. My brother. Yes. I thought you rejected me. 
Look, Mama, if he needs my help, let him come by himself. Is that why you're crying? My son, you don't understand. Ever since you left, things have not been the same. Do you know that you've been left? I've never renovated that family house. What? Um, Mama, it's all right. If that's the problem, I, I'll, I'll give you some money to do the renovation, okay? Or you can give it to him to do it. It's all right, it's all right. Gina Edum, Obin has finished everything. He has sold all the land. Finished all the money from the family business. Under the influence of that evil man, Udemba. Udemba has ruled my family. Udemba? Udemba. Oh. Udemba has ruled my family. So it was <laughs> now Udemba that Obina found solace in. <sighs> Udemba deceived him into firearms business. Firearms? Firearms! Oh my god. What sort of rubbish is that? <laughs> the police arrested them. I took them to Abuja to face firearms tribunal. Let them know. Let them know. Did you do my son? Please help me. Help me. Hello. <laughs> Mama, Mama, it, it, Mama, stand up. It, it's all right. Stand up. Mama, stand up. It's okay. Calm down. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. It's all right. Stand up. Mama, you know what you'll do for me now. Just dry your tears. Take your bath. Have some food and rest. It wasn't your fault that Obina got arrested. Okay? Jine Edu, Obina is your brother. Can't you help him? Mama, the oil has been spilled. Oh. The issue is now a government case and it's beyond me. Oh. Demba. Obina has made his bed like that. Mama, let him lie on it that way. Okay? Odemba has my Mama, family. Mama, come, come. Odemba has ruined my family. Mama, it's all right. It's all right, Mama, let's go. We'll talk about it some more, okay? Just... <laughs> Is that why you want to keep yourself hyper? 